Welcome back. How to make an animated map effect. Go to the fusion page, having created a fusion clip of the appropriate length. On the graph place the following nodes on the node graph. Image plane 3D. Merge 3D. Camera 3D. Point light. Renderer 3D. Connect them as shown and then put the merge 3D node into viewer 1. Go to the internet and find a picture of the map that you like. I have chosen a map of that famous ghetto area in southern England called Surrey. Import this image file into the project and add to your node graph. Connect the image into the image plane 3D node. With the image plane 3D node selected, go to the inspector, under transform change the X axis under rotation to minus 90 degrees. Go to the camera 3D node and adjust the camera to be looking down on your map. Go to the renderer 3D node and in the inspector tick enable lighting. Now select the point light and move it to a position above your map and adjust the light settings to your liking. Now add a background node and choose a color for it, I like red for this. Add two ellipse nodes and connect in series as shown to the background node. Now merge the background node to your media in image of the map. With the merge node in viewer 1, adjust the sizes of each of the ellipse nodes to your liking. These will be used as the start and end points of your root animations on your map. Once you have placed them accordingly, select the merge node you just created and press shift and space to bring up the tool selector. Find a paint node and add it, it should connect between the merge and the image plane 3D node. Adjust the color in the inspector to your liking for the paint node, select the stroke tool here and draw a line following the root of the map between your start and end points. Go to a position on your timeline that you'd like this animation to paint on and under modifiers in the inspector you will find a new stroke you just applied. Go to the stroke controls and find the right on control. Set a keyframe for start and end at 0. Go forward to where you want the stroke animation to end and set to 1 in the end field. You should now see the line draw on when you play back. Final thing to adjust is the camera if you want a more dynamic look. Select the camera 3D node. With the camera previously set to be looking down on your map, go to the inspector and select Use Target. With the playhead at a position where you want to set the camera position, keyframe the X, Y, Z values of the target. Here I'm focusing the camera on the start position of the root animation. To approximately follow the animation move forward to the end point of the root animation on the timeline then adjust the camera target to the end of your root animation and set another keyframe. When you play back you should see your animation in full. Hope this was useful. Please subscribe.